All right. Joining us on site, he's at a uh, top secret location, uh, is our newest member, uh, Kevin. Don't forget to unmute yourself because you'll need to do that. Uh, newest member of the Eastside Real Estate team. Uh, Kevin, welcome to our podcast. Glad to be on the podcast, Dan. All right. So uh, you don't have any idea how this is going to go. I didn't prep you for it at all. I didn't give you any questions, nothing. So um, we'll just kind of start by introduce yourself. Um, tell us who you are, where you're from. Yeah, I um, currently reside in Burien, Washington, um, originally from California, moved here in 2017. I was originally slated to become a lawyer, but then I found the avenue of real estate and I fell in love. Nice. Now, you've been doing real estate for a while, but you took a little break. That is correct. Yes. Yeah. How many years in real estate then? Um, in total, about two and a half. Two and a half years. All right. Yeah. So, to, um, you know, as we were talking with Tucker, some some success stories. Um, what about the real estate industry do you love the most? And maybe if you have a success story that you can share, uh, we'd love to hear that. Yeah. Initially, I was in the real estate game for investment purposes. Um, there are small. There, there's a small group of people that go under the guise of fire, which is financially independent, retire early, and so with fire and being a part of that group of people there's different avenues to attain fire whether it's like stocks and investment or real estate but then as soon as i helped my first buyer in bremerton find their house and going through the process of like going through multiple different houses and going like beating out other offers in a multiple offer situation it was pretty enjoyable like it was getting that deal and helping out my clients in that respect was so awesome and amazing I get that. There's no other feeling like helping out your client. Yeah. And I think um, that whole wealth perspective, we've talked a lot about that lately um, as a team. And, and we're actually going to be hosting a game night up in uh, the Everett office. So if anybody wants to learn about the beginning investment, please do uh, RSVP. We've got a link. Probably we'll put that in the email here because it's something we're going to be doing or not the email, but the, the um, lower um What's it called? Down below in the description, I uh, put a link for our cash flow game night. So, Kevin, what are th those skills uh, that you bring as you were heading towards the um, uh, lawyer? What What are some of those skills that you're going to bring over uh, to helping clients in this business? I think it's knowledge retention and being able to work under high stress situations. Definitely. And being able to negotiate for my clients through thick and thin. Yeah, I, I, I really do uh, love the negotiation part of real estate. And, um, you know, it's it's all about leverage and then being able to really um, know your contracts. Right. So knowing yep. the legal documents. So those, those are both translatable. So um, hobbies and interests. What do you do when you're not um, working? Um, it's either at the gym or going on hikes with my two dogs and my fiance. Nice. And camping. Yeah. Camping. Have you been on any good hikes lately? Um, not currently. I've been trying to really buckle down and work on my business currently. Gotcha. Uh, well, all, all work and no play makes for a no person. So go, <laughs> go for a hike every now and then. No, but yeah, right now you need to do your open houses. Um, okay. So then the, the last thing is um, why should somebody choose to work with you in real estate? I think what I bring to the table and what separates me from most real estate agents is definitely the team that I'm on. Um, I have a really good mentor on my team. He's amazing. He's been really knowledgeable, really helpful. Um, probably one of the best mentors I've had so far in my early life. But aside from that, it's like the, the whole brokerage aspect of what we stand for and people at place and Keller Williams with Ben Kinney. The, the fact that we have a database of buyers and sellers of multiple like multiple levels and at different aspects of different price points is huge our marketing strategies are pretty unbeatable um like i believe yesterday when you went pending it was a multiple offer situation over listing price with few to no contingencies and that's something you don't see every day in today's market yeah. Well, it's awesome. We're we're uh, very excited to have you a part of the team. And uh, the one thing that I'll add, you know, to skill set is hustle. Uh, Kevin definitely uh, is putting in the time and um, and has the experience. I mean, I mean, one of the things about um, 
about real estate right now is there there are such um, weird challenges in our market with inventory and stuff that that you really do need to have somebody that cares about this as a career and isn't doing it part time. They're doing it full time and they're they're really learning their craft, paying attention. Um, so welcome to the team, Kevin. I so appreciate you uh, being a part and a part of this podcast. I'm going to let you get back to looking at houses because I know you're out there doing some tours today. So thanks yeah. for joining us. Thanks for being here, Dan. Uh-huh.